Have you ever been curious about Namju Hyuk's love life? In today's video, we bring you a list of all the alleged girls Namju Hyuk dated. Let's get into it. Lee Sung Hyun. Namju Hyuk and Lee Sung Hyun were truly the sweethearts of the film industry. They were an adorable couple and everybody was heartbroken when they announced that they were no longer together. But let's start from the beginning. Lee Sung Hyun was once signed under the same agency as Namju Hyuk, so their friendship went way back to their early modeling days. They even worked on several modeling projects together and occasionally accompanied each other on red carpet events. Then, both of them were casted as the romantic leads in weightlifting fairy Gimbokju in 2016, and some might say that falling in love with each other was bound to happen. As the pair grew closer and closer, the dating rumors had no end. The rumors about their relationship were literally everywhere at that time, and when they wrapped up weightlifting fairy Gimbokju in 2017, the pair finally announced their relationship to the world. The excitement from their relationship wouldn't last long, though. Their relationship was completely confirmed by their mutual agency, YG Entertainment, in April of 2017, but the couple decided to split just a few months after that in August of 2017. YG Entertainment said in a statement at that time, We checked with Nam Joo Hyuk and Lee Sung Hyun, and it is true that the two recently broke up. The agency also said that their hectic and busy schedules were the reason why the couple decided to go their separate ways. But with some newfound information, there's a possibility that the couple hasn't let go at all. In February of 2022, SBS News sparked a rumor that Nam Joo Hyuk and Lee Sung Hyun are back together. They pointed out the times that these two actors have been seen wearing matching outfits and accessories, playing with the idea that they might have given their relationship a second chance. Unfortunately, nothing has been confirmed by their agency or the actors themselves, nor has anyone denied the rumors. One thing for sure, their fans would be over the moon seeing them back together again. Bae Suzy. It's to no one's surprise that Bae Suzy is on this list because the chemistry she and Nam Joo Hyuk have is simply too good to be true. Nam Joo Hyuk and Bae Suzy were the main stars of the popular Korean drama Startup, which revolves around a woman who is dreaming of becoming an entrepreneur like Steve Jobs. The catch is that this woman gets caught up in a love triangle between a man who was secretly her first love and another man who was only pretending to be her first love. Of course, Bae Suzy plays the role of So Dal Mi, a woman with a dream of becoming Korea's Steve Jobs. Nam Joo Hyuk plays the role of Nam Do San, a founder of Samsung Tech who used to be the pride of his family as a math genius, but has gotten terribly shy. So Dalmi mistakenly believes that he was her first love, but the reality is that Nam Do San never knew her. Since their on-screen chemistry is so good, it only made the fans wonder if there could be something going on between them behind the scenes. The rumors doubled in size when Nam Do Hyuk posted a picture of him and Bae Suzy on his personal Instagram account. Fans pointed out one thing, which was that Nam Do Hyuk rarely posts pictures of other women unless he's dating them. Nam Do Hyuk also posted the pictures just a short while after he broke up with his previous girlfriend, Lee Sung Hyun, which made his fans even more curious. They kept asking whether he and Bae Suzy are just friends or if he moved on and found new love. Well, it seems like we might never find out the truth if there has ever been something more between these two. It's been well over a year and all things are pointing to these two being very close friends since they never confirmed their relationship. Han Ji Min. Han Ji Min is another one of Nam Joo Hyuk's close friends and dear colleagues with whom he was tied in dating rumors. In 2020, these two met on the set for Jose. This movie talks about the story of a woman and a man who embark on a beautiful chapter of their lives after meeting one another. This actually wasn't the first time Nam Joo Hyuk and Han Ji Min worked together, as they previously teamed up and acted together for the TV series The Light in Your Eyes, also known as Radiant. In one of her interviews, Han Ji Min had this to share about working with Nam Joo Hyuk. Radiant left a deep impression on viewers, but there weren't many scenes where I was acting together with Nam Joo Hyuk. I also enjoyed that project and enjoyed working with Nam Joo Hyuk in it too, so I thought we could make up for that when we met again. We talked together about how we could create something different. She then went on to compare what it's been like working with Nam Joo Hyuk on Radiant and then on Jose and said, When we were working on Radiant, I felt a lot like I needed to take the lead. For Jose, I relied on him more and him being there felt reassuring. Just from Han Ji Min's words, it's obvious that these two are probably very close behind the cameras as well. She also shared that she felt very comfortable working with Nam Joo Hyuk again and that along with the director, Nam Joo Hyuk was the only person she could talk with about her worries. Nam Joo Hyuk had a similar praise to say about Han Ji Min. He said, We filmed a lot together, so we were able to communicate on a deeper level as we discussed with the director for each scene. It was exactly their precious bond that they have developed over years working with each other that made fans wonder what it would be like if these two made a real life couple. Although they would undoubtedly be an adorable couple, I think it's safe to say that these will just stay as rumors. Stephanie E. Stephanie E 
is another close friend of Nam Joo Hyuk, but they too have also met on the set for Startup. Stephanie Yi plays the role of Dong Sa Ha, who is a sassy designer for Samsung Tech who decides to quit her job to pursue something less generic. Apart from being colleagues, they've been friends for years now. Their friendship goes way back to when both of them used to be fashion models under YG K Plus, a modeling management company of YG Entertainment, which is where they stayed as colleagues before both of them moved to different agencies. Their fans were quick to realize how adorable they look together, especially in the pictures they both posted on their Instagram accounts back in 2014. What's interesting is that although they are great friends in real life, their characters in Startup are not very fond of each other. Unfortunately, these two are just great friends and I can't see any romance blooming between them anytime soon. Kim So Hyun, Nam Joo Hyuk and Kim So Hyun met on the set for the romantic high school melodrama Who Are You School 2015 where Nam Joo Hyuk took up the role of a high school student. The drama follows the story of Han Yi An, played by Nam Joo Hyuk, who was a talented swimmer at his high school. He becomes friends with Go Eun Byol, played by Kim So Hyun, and ends up falling in love with her. It would be too easy for Han Yi An, and soon enough, he notices something strange about Eun Byol. It turns out that Eun Byol was actually Eun Bi, Eun Byol's twin sister. In an interview, Nam Joo Hyuk shared his thoughts about Kim So Hyun and said, From a very young age, she's had a lot of experience in drama, and she is my senior in acting. On the set, she could be a cute high school student, but could also be a mature young woman, caring and considerate. Although their characters in Who Are You had a lot of adorable moments together and the fans absolutely adored their relationship, the reality is a little different. In real life, they don't seem as close as their characters and instead seem to maintain a strictly professional relationship. Ideal type. Before we wrap up the video, let's look at Nam Joo Hyuk's ideal type because he for sure has a taste. In 2017, he shared how he acts when he falls in love with someone and said, I'm not the bad boy type. I'm really shy and I find it hard to express my emotions. But when I fall in love, I go all in, almost to the extent of being too much. I'm ready to fall in love with a girl who will be my source of strength as I continue my promotions as an actor. He also shared he would like a relationship where he can depend on his other half and vice versa. Nam Joo Hyuk revealed that if he likes someone, he likes them for a long time. He described the time he had a crush when he was in third grade in elementary school and liked her for three whole years. He dated his crush in sixth grade, but couldn't forget about her until eighth grade, which is almost six years. So it's obvious Nam Joo Hyuk is very romantic. He continued about his ideal type. I can't really say it explicitly, but I think through this drama, it's become someone like Bok Ju. I thought it might be nice to have someone who works out and exercises alongside you and gives you strength along the way. The actor also shared that he likes someone who would give him advice and strength. I hope that soon he will be able to find the right person for him. That's it for today. Do you guys think that Nam Joo Hyuk and Lee Sung Kyun are back together? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Bye.